Hi everyone, this is Dave from Geekanoids and this is my review of the Arcos One Vision 4GB MP3 player. A big, big thank you to MyMemory.com to sending me this unit to review. Now let's take a look inside the packaging and I'll show you what you get for your money. So, we get lots of goodies in here. First of all, we obviously get the Arcos One Vision itself, very very compact unit, extremely useful at this size because it's so so easy to slip into a pocket. So we come back and take a closer look at this in a short while. Then we've got some paperwork, we've got a little leaflet there for 35 free MP3s from eMusic. Then we've got some warranty information. Got a little mini CD here which is video conversion software for the PC and then in various languages we've got some uh, sort of setup instructions this is the English one here so you get a nice full colour quick start guide and it guides you around the various controls on the unit as well as how to navigate through the menu system and then in this package here uh, I haven't actually opened this because I haven't used the USB cable but you do get a USB cable this is for connecting it to a computer for transferring music uh, video and other data onto the unit as well as obviously charging the device and then in this package in here we get the Arcos supplied headphones and these are pretty good quality they're, they're bog standard headphones really uh, in ear they go very slightly into the ear a little bit of padding around them uh, not the best quality headphones you're going to get, you may want to upgrade them, but certainly for the price they do perform uh, more than admirably on the Arcos One Vision. And then to the player itself, it's supplied like this with a, a film over the front, so we're going to remove that now so you can take a closer look. And this is the Arcos One Vision. It's a very, very nice looking player, it's made of plastic. If I just turn around there, you can see the Arcos One Vision logo on the back. Now, a guide around the controls. We have got on this side completely blank. This side, just a little lanyard connector on the corner here. The top's completely blank. On the bottom, we've got a earphone socket, which is a standard 3.5mm audio jack. Here we've got an on-off switch for turning the player on and off. And then we've got that mini USB connection for charging and transferring data onto the device. And then on the front of the unit we've got some buttons. Let's give you a closer look at these. We've got a previous uh, button for moving back one track or for moving forward one track here. And this is also used for moving up and down the menu system. And then we've also got a power button for putting the unit into sleep mode and also for going backwards in the menu system. Then we've got a play pause button here and this is used for uh, both playing and pausing music but also for selecting options in the menu. And then we've got a volume up and down button on this right hand side here. Now it will play back MP3s, WMAs, FLAC, APE and WAV formats when it comes to music. You can also view JPEG and BMP photos Plus, it will play back videos which are just about watchable on the one and a half inch screen. It even displays text files and using it is really, really easy. It connects via USB and then you drag and drop files onto it on a Windows, Mac or Linux computer. Now, battery has a claimed life of 21 hours. For music, I got just over that at 22 hours. So let's turn this on now and give you a look at the screen. So we've turned the switch on on the bottom and then we have to push the power button on the front and this starts the little MP3 player up and the screen isn't bad as I say it's 128 by 128 pixel screen 1.5 inch and then we've got the menu system here which we go up and down using these buttons here so I'm going down the menu system and then back up the menu system and as you can see we've got choice of music, video, photos record function because it will actually record that was one thing I just didn't show you on that initial tour just here little tiny dot on this side and this is the microphone pickup 
so you can actually record memos on the device. Then we've got files because it does actually read text files and also lyric files as well. And then we've got a settings menu. And then background to music. To, so to go into this menu we would push this button here and we've gone into the list view for the music and here we can look at titles, artists, albums, favourites, recordings, files which is recorded files, update my library or breakpoint player. Now if I go into title and it gives me a list of music I've already got on here in various mp3 or wma formats and perhaps we go down to this one and click play and then the music's playing with a nice graphical display there we can play and pause and then click play again to start the music playing and then of course we can skip back to the beginning of the track or we can skip onto the next track and then we've got volume up and down here and it shows you the volume in the top right hand corner of the display and let's pause that and we go out of this menu and all the way back and we're going to go down to video and show you some video playing now the video is just about watchable on this tiny screen you're not going to do a lot of video watching on it but for the odd sort of YouTube clip you want to carry around with you maybe you've got a few funny videos you want to show to your mates it's more than usable the screen and when it comes to sound the actual sound quality is extremely good for such a tiny player and for such a, a cheap player as well you'll get an extremely good sound quality the music I was listening to uh, the sound quality is almost comparable to the iPod touch uh, almost on a level par actually when, when you come to think of it the voice quality nice and warm and detailed I think the only thing it lacked was just a bit of oomph when it came to um, sort of bass tones and those higher end tones as well it seemed to just lack a little bit in those areas now this is available for under £30, yep you heard me right, under £30 from MyMemory.com and for that you're getting a very useful 4GB MP3 player that also does photos, videos and voice memos and a full colour screen. Now to me that is excellent value for money. This is my review of the Arcos One Vision 4GB MP3 and video player. Thank you very much for listening. Please do come back soon and check out more video reviews on the Geekanoids channel. This video review is sponsored by Crucial, the memory experts. They provide reliable PC, notebook and Mac memory to boost your system performance and improve your general workflow.